So the storm started about eight in the morning. It was an all day ordeal. The water was coming in over here. And we kept grabbing all of the towels we had to dry it up until we were out of towels. We started grabbing everything we could grab. And the Lord kept going right in. About two days went by. We have no power, we have no water. Our son has a severe mold allergy. So he was starting to get red circles under his eyes. He was starting to lose his appetite. And these were all signs that we had seen before he, he's had two seizures. So these were signs we had seen before his other two seizures. And then finally we started smelling it. We started smelling the mold. When my husband started pulling out baseboards and floorboards, the water went all the way along the wall, all the way over to here. And pulling this out, he found that there was in fact some mold in the house, which explained a lot of our son's symptoms. And that's when we called our doctor. Um, and that's when she told us we had to get out of our house. So that night, we actually ended up having to sleep in our house. And I could hear him sleeping next to me, and he was just wheezing. And you know, your mama heart is breaking, because I'm just like, I got to get this, I got to get my kid out of here as soon as I possibly can. We've been praying this entire time that God would direct our steps, and he would open doors, and he would lead us, the people we needed to be led to, and we got the call that you guys were on your way to our house. We saw people in orange shirts. They're helping us get repaired because of the storm. This is my first time volunteering with Samaritan's Purse. Came here with my husband to help remove damaged drywall, trim, to help decrease the mold in the home. We've got people up on the roof putting tarps over some missing shingles to decrease any more water damage to the roof. This is one of my horses, and if you press this button, Now we know our son will be healthy. We don't have to worry about it once it's done. Um, and then your crew is gonna come in and help my husband do a lot of the work, which is amazing. We're just a family of three trying to do this on our own. So it was, it's really nice to have people come and give you a hand. And I love seeing the church fulfill its purpose and do what God asked us to do, be his hands and be his feet. Heavenly Father, we just hope that uh, you'll be a blessing to this family in the days to come. And we thank you and praise your name. In Jesus' holy and gracious name, amen. 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 We're here to bless the family, but we also, too, get blessed seeing the relief. Having a group like this come in, they can start to see the transformation <laughs> of this damaged house becoming their home again. You know, it's, it's an answer to prayer. Even though this looks like complete disaster, <laughs> um, he's got us. God provides.